my name is Nitya Satkriyananda and uh, currently I'm in Mumbai and I finished my 10th uh, in October uh, last year as I was doing the IGCSE course. Um, I had no idea of coming for this in an awakening at all. I went to Cambodia by throwing tantrums left, right, center, and I, I, I don't know, Swami made it happen for me. And I made it to Cambodia, but uh, I decided to make the reality be caused for my mother and grandmother. Um, so this third eye awakening process, the minute I was told that, uh, you know, I think somebody mentioned casu casually that uh, children under 14, it's 100% success. Immediately block came up. Oh, I just turned 15. A year, definitely it's not gonna happen now. But I don't know, first process, top, I don't know, that, that, that thought just completely vanished. And uh, I, slowly it developed. Obviously it's not gonna be like a miraculous suddenly you're just seeing everything the way your eyes see it. No, absolutely not. You have to work on it as, as much as the master works on it. And um, working on it little by little, bit by bit, I've uh, come across this extremely strange experience. I come from a very traditional and orthodox Tamil Brahmin family where uh, everyone can read, write, speak, understand Tamil and a whole lot of other South Indian, Indian, uh, you know, foreign languages. Uh, and although I can speak and understand Tamil, I can not even figure out one single letter when it comes to reading and writing. Um, but I would say, this is really weird, so hold your breath. I can read Tamil fluently, whereas I even struggle to read English, which I top in my school results. I, I top in English almost every time, but I'm struggling to read that. So I'm still getting rid of that SDHD. But Tamil is something I cannot read or write with my physical two eyes. But with Swamiji's uh, amazing third eye awakening, I am reading Tamil blindfolded. <laughs> and uh, what's even more weird is that uh, the language Telugu, which is another South Indian language, um, I can't even understand or speak but I'm even reading Telugu now. <laughs> so it, it, that's as amazing as it gets. So it's not that what your mind knows your third eye is reading. It's what is there in the cosmos your third eye knows. So he's just simply awakened your straightaway path or I, I'd say door of accessing everything from the cosmos. I used to never understand why he used to say the browse center is the browsing center. But I get it now. So thank you so much Swamiji. And I just wanted to share about that. Um, if I can, just another thing is this Basma bag that we got. Uh, after Cambodia, I used to tell everyone, we're living with Mahadeva, we're living as Mahadeva. After getting this Basma bag, the experiences we're having, I'd say it's not even living with and living as Mahadeva. It's way, way beyond that. So I don't want to, you know, put anything in your mind by using my words. Uh, it's just that it's an amazing experience, so you just have to be here.